Andy. Hi, everyone. A very good evening to all of you. Thank you for joining us via Zoom on the topic of Battle of the Cells. I'm sure all of you are either tuning in from the comfort of your home, your offices, maybe you are on your way back home, and some of you, you are from as far as the United States, Finland, Seychelles, Philippines. Hello, everyone. Wherever you're from, a very good evening. Okay, in Singapore, we are in the evening, 7.30 plus, and we are coming to you live from our Avita head office. My name is Tengi. Uh, if you find my name is quite unique, I was actually born in Myanmar, but I grew up in Singapore. Yeah, and at the same time, those of you who are also watching us from Facebook Live, Okay, uh, and for those who knows that friends would like to tune in from Facebook, uh, you can catch us on our Avita official Facebook on uh, web uh, page. Okay, so tonight's topic is really about battle of the stars, battle of the cells. Okay, battle of the cells. Yes. So what does it mean? Okay, we are all made up of cells, from a baby to where, how, no matter how old you are. We are all made up of cells. And during, especially during this period, we, you hear so many news, so much news, so much information. Sometimes you feel, is this correct? Or is this true? Is this fake? And what's really happening around the world that is affecting our health? Okay, some of you may be fearful of what's going to happen next. All I want to share with you tonight is really about how we can take control of our own health and our own life. Yeah, uh, about 11 years ago, like what Wendy shared, uh, our company launched this cell therapy product called Celogen, and it has benefited so many people. And tonight, what I'll be sharing a little bit about is a little bit on biology, on what our body does and what happens inside our body. At the same time, I would like to share what we can do to prevent ourselves from getting sick, catching the virus, no matter what virus it is, and then what we can do going forward to keep our health in a good state and at the same time preserve and enhance our immune system. Okay, shall we start? Yep. Okay, Let's, let me show you a little animation. Ah, I think some of you uh, unable to enjoy the freedom of going to the uh, supermarkets, to your grocery store. But in Singapore, we have a little fortune. Okay, imagine yourself going to a grocery store this morning. You are in the queue and suddenly someone behind you just, achoo, sneezed. I think at this current time, all the eyes will be on this person who sneezed. So what actually happened to our body at that time? From the sneeze, the virus, the flu virus or the cold virus actually travel into the person in front of this person or surrounding and the virus go into our system. Okay, and then get stuck into our lung, stick to our lung membrane, lung walls, etc. And thus, this is the start of the virus who is present in our body. Yeah. And then... What happens next? You know, our cells are made up of membranes, thick walls that are protecting, and uh, it actually made up of collagen, fats, and also proteins, which helps to really safeguard and allows nutrients, allows certain things to penetrate into our cells. At the same time, also release whatever things that's not necessary uh, out to do outside of our cells. And at the same time, forbid entry of uh, certain things, okay? So that's how our cells work. And when this virus got in, it was very sneaky. It found itself a host to pretend that it is not a virus, okay? And it, it hooked on to this host and then just sneakily get into our cells. Our cells thought it's just a friend. Okay, your, one of your family member, and then you allow it to come in. Then realize, oh my, it's an enemy. It is an enemy that is present uh, inside here. Yeah. So what's, what did they do? 
they make an announcement, alert all our cells to come and fight against this enemy. And then at the same time, they help to conquer. At the same time, inform all the other cells about what is this virus like. Okay, so the information is passed down to all the cells. Now the question is, when you meet a super virus, is our army of antibodies strong enough to fight? Okay, do you have enough antibodies in your system to defeat this intruder? That is the main questions that we are looking at in today's uh, era. It's no longer about whether there is a vaccine, but really, is our antibodies, is our immune system strong enough to fight against all these viruses? Tonight, I'm not going to talk about what is COVID-19. I think you have enough information about it. What I'm going to talk about will be what we can do to safeguard against not only COVID-19, but also against any other viruses. Yeah. So our cells function, this is basically the cross-sectional uh, diagram of our cells. Okay. And what, it, what does it do? It will have instructions that will give the cells what are the things they need to manufacture. Okay. It will be made out of proteins. Okay. At the same time, it's fats. Okay. Then there's a factory that uh, processes it. And then we also have the membrane. Okay, the cell membrane it becomes a very important, important component here. Okay, cell membrane, we actually make up of, uh, we have the cell matrix, which forms a, a, like a layer that is uh, very strong. It prevents cells uh, from other things, nutrients and all that from escaping and also intruders from coming into our cells. Yeah? So when this collagen or the cell membrane gets weakened down, okay, weakened down, that's the time where our system weakens and our uh, aging starts. Okay? In our normal aging um, process, when you're 30 year old, 45 year old and 60 years old, we can tell the difference. You notice that your skin don't look so firm we don't look so radiant, we start to have lines form. So we always think that collagen actually causes our skin and our, our looks to uh, be aged and all that. But actually, it's not just collagen, it's the, our cell matrix. Okay, when this, all this get weakened up, we, have, we start to look older than our age. Nowadays, we even saw people who are experiencing premature aging, like you tend to look older. Like maybe you are from the same cohort, you graduated at the same time, but when you go for your class reunion, your 10th anniversary, 20th anniversary, you notice that some of us don't look that, don't look that different from when we left school. Some look very different. What is the factor? Really is how fast we age, okay? And some of us, we know that people are, they may be in their 60s, but some still look like they are 45. So what is the secret? It's not just the amount of skincare that they use. It's really, it's from inside. And what is affecting the, the health of our cells, the matrix of our cell membrane, etc. cetera, is re really, we look at the environment that we are in. I'm sure you have been reading news about when, when everybody oh, in, uh, in countries like Italy, in countries like Philippines, uh, even in the United States, when, they, when the country is under lockdown, the whole environment changed. There's lesser pollution, and then uh, the sea is much cleaner. And for the first time, I see Manila traffic from the photos. Uh, the, the highways are clear of traffic. At the same time, the sky is so clear, so blue, so beautiful. We were originally like that. But all due to our lifestyle changes, all these are the source of free radicals. So what are some of the free radicals? Okay, it can be from work stress, pollution in the environment, okay, unhealthy eating habits. We have been eating out a lot where food are laden with chemical preservatives, etc. Okay, and then we are taking lots of synthetic drugs or medicine, which are also a form of free source of free radicals. And then inflammation, which is the root of all diseases. 
is always happening. We have Wi-Fi everywhere. We can't live without Wi-Fi. Now that many countries are under lockdown, people are staying home, the telco companies are giving a lot of free Wi-Fi access, free data access. Okay, all these are causing a lot of free radicals in our environment. The radiation from the sun, as well as radiation from all these equipment, electronic equipment, gadgets, etc. It causes the immune to be in a disorder state. Okay? from the uh, radiation, uh, fertilizers that are uh, using chemical fertilizing, etc. So what is, what is causing all this? Okay, these free radicals causes oxidative stress and damage to our cell membrane. They start to attack our cell membrane and then it starts to get loosened up. Just like a gate. Okay, when you get attacked so much, it gets to have holes. It gets to have loosening up of the cell membrane and then damage starts to happen. So when these free radicals causes oxidative stress, chronic inflammation, chronic diseases, and physical aging, it, all these start to make havoc in our system, in our body. Even in, as early as 2004, there has been this article in New Time magazine that states that inflammation is the secret killer of all diseases, including heart attacks, Alzheimer's, everything. Okay, so the main root of issues is inflammation. And what does chronic inflammation cause to our body? It creates chronic diseases. What are some of the chronic diseases? Joint, in terms of joints, people have arthritis, rheumatism. Okay, this is a form of inflammation of our joints. For the skin, people develop eczema, psoriasis, and etc. Heart, hypertension, cardiac arrest, hypertensive uh, uh, ED, erectile dysfunction. In terms of lung, asthma, cancer, kidney, digestive system, uh, our eyes, okay, multiple organs. All these causes, the main root of all these causes is chronic inflammation. So if you know that this is the main cause, if we can do something about an anti-inflammation, that will be our, on our way to finding a remedy. And what does all this cause globally? It is not just a disease, a health condition that disrupts you. Actually, it disrupts everybody because it is caused by a lifestyle development. Here we see, we look at the chart of diabetes epidemic. Okay, about four years ago in Singapore, our prime minister identified as Diabetes is a very chronic issue that is affecting Singapore. Okay, when he made that speech in, in his National Day rally, we know it is crucial, it is important because he won't mention it if it doesn't affect at a large scale level. So from that year onwards, after that, uh, that fateful speech, all our propaganda, our education, including how we eat our food, how the food is consumed, the lifestyle, there was a drastic change to reduce the number of diabetic cases in Singapore. Why that, what does it mean? As you know, Singapore is a small country. We are less than six, uh, 6 million people population. We do not have natural resources, human resources. Human is our workforce as well as our most important resources. So thus, we cannot have a sick society. We cannot have uh, an, a, a, a workforce that is depleting or is down with illness. It will be taxing to our government system and our healthcare system. Yeah? So we look at diabetes being increasing. Is it only affecting Singapore? I don't think so. Okay, this is an issue that a lot of countries, many countries are facing. Let's look at why do we especially highlight diabetes? Because it leads to many other illnesses. It leads to complication in dental health, complication during pregnancy, hypertension, eye problem, it can cause blindness, amputations of the limbs, nervous system breakdown, heart diseases, stroke, etc. I remember towards near to the retirement of my late dad, he was diagnosed with diabetes. 
at that time i thought okay it's just something that you need to inject you need to inject insulin and then you need to really take care of your diet take measurement of your blood sugar but i didn't know it was so complicated but i got to know when he was hospitalized for liver cancer i noticed that a lot of things need to check on his sugar level because they can't do certain operation they can't do certain medication due to this complication and worldwide it is a leading cause of death do you hear people die of diabetes i don't think so you know you, you will never hear oh uh, my this person so and so passed away because of diabetes no you won't hear that but it will you will hear the main cause of it maybe heart attack a stroke a brain uh, a brain stem stroke etc okay what leads to that is actually due to this thickening of our arteries okay that narrowing and hardening of our artery which is a progress as you see from the chart here you will see that the walls are clean in the first decade but it's already starting to be thickening with fats okay in uh with cholesterol etc from the third decade onward you notice this area is already thickening and forming a wall of fats around the arteries around the artery walls by the fourth decade which is usually if we look at our chronological age that means when we are about 40 plus years old okay, we start to have different issues that's why i remember during my grandma's or my parents era only when you are in your late 40s or 50s, you start to develop hypertension, diabetes, etc. But nowadays, I hear people as young as 20 plus having diabetic condition or having high blood pressure. Why is that so? Because this whole process has really drastically been shortened due to our lifestyle and our diet. What are some of the complications that atherosclerosis will cause? Okay, it can cause in different parts of our body. In the brain, it will cause stroke. Okay, if it's in the eye, it will cause retinopathy, which is blindness. Then in the heart, you have your uh, heart attack, okay, and etc. Kidney failure, uh, ED, erectile dysfunction. In the limbs, we could we could have blockage. In the, of the arteries in your limbs, which cause you uh, not being able to walk properly, having different uh, issues, etc. So this is the oxidative damage caused by the free radical, which eventually it could lead to damage DNA. That's why when we know the cause of it, we need to rectify it, take action against it, and do something about it. Even cancer, it's a big word. Nowadays, we say it so casually because it has become so common. But then we come to think of it. What really causes cancer? It's the cancer progression can start from the aging process as young as when you're 18. Okay. And when there's mutation of our cells, it could lead to eventually stage one to stage four cancer. But nowadays, when someone is diagnosed of cancer, you will not open here, stage three, last stage. By then, you can't do much about anything about it. When my dad was diagnosed with liver cancer, it was already fourth stage. And the doctor said he has only six months to live. Sadly, he didn't complete six months. Within two months since diagnosis, he passed away. So at that time, we all I understand cancer is bad. Cancer is... Uh, something that is serious, but I didn't know how we can prevent. It's always, I always keep thinking that it's really up to our luck, or in Singapore, we call it king swear. If you are lucky, you won't get it. If you are unlucky, you say swear, then you gonna, you know, that kind, of, that kind of saying, that means you will get it. Yeah, so, but now understanding it at cellular level, through cellular therapy, and different kind of education, I understand Actually, we can do something about it. All of us, not just us from Avita, but really all of us can do something about it. Yeah, so in order to prevent cancer mutation, and we need to understand why it actually happened, okay? 
So there has been this secret, unknown secret, or a, a secret uh, that is known to many rich and famous about this anti-aging uh, therapy, cell therapy among the rich and famous. I've heard of my country's previous um, uh, dictator. He used to travel to Swiss to really uh, get himself injected with cell therapy to look young. We keep thinking it is something to look young so that he won't die so early. Yeah. And, then, and after that, I start to understand actually it's not just to prevent yourself to look young, uh, to prevent yourself from looking old, but rather it is to make yourself healthy have the vitality, you still get to enjoy what you like to do. Yeah. So for those of you who are thinking of whether you want to check into some of these clinics, okay, it's in Switzerland, Germany, it's quite common. Yeah, people fly in there and check into all these clinics, stay for about two weeks, get their treatments done, get their tests done, and then come out. They go there once a year. And each, each uh, session is about US, 250,000, yeah, around, around that, that kind of range. And it's not something that uh, an ordinary person can do that. So what is actually the cell therapy? What does it mean? What are the different types? Yeah, we have the stem cell implantation, where it's used mainly for medical treatments, for Parkinson's disease, Down syndrome, etc., for autologous stem cell therapy. Okay, this is practiced by the professionals those are the doctors and the clinics. Then we have cell therapy by injectables. This is also getting, starting to get common. Okay, people go to Korea, people travel to Thailand, even to uh, Russia and all that to get cell therapy treatment. It's about US 50,000 per treatment at Swiss clinics. Okay, and then uh, it's mainly made up of ship placenta, placenta-based kind of cell therapy injection. Then the third method we have, cell therapy by oral ingestion. That means taking it. And our cell gen is one of it using fish DNA. In the market, there are many products that are made of uh, hormones, hormonal base or placenta base. Okay, here, our uniqueness of cell gen is we use fish or marine cell therapy because it is of the safest nature and it is also the closest to our body cells. Yeah. It is highly effective. You can, some can feel almost as immediate as within a few days, few weeks, okay? And uh, it is affordable, highly affordable as compared to the cell therapy treatment by injectables. In the market, about US 350, in Singapore, about Singapore 473 for a one month uh, uh, consumption, okay? And thanks to this visionary and also someone with so much foresight. Our founder and CEO, Ms. Lee, Ms. Lee Xiangying, she is now, if I can tell you a secret, she's now about 70 plus, yeah, and still looking so young, and she runs even faster than me. Yeah, so it's amazing. When you get the chance to meet her, you must really get to know her. She's, to me, she stands for really what she, what she says. She, say, she always tells us, life is a gift. Never take it for granted. With that in mind, she started Avita. She researched and developed Celagen. And after, within two years of launching Avita, she launched Celagen. That was in 2009. That's why uh, my dear host, uh, Wendy, said I started taking Celagen since day one. I had the honor. Okay, when, when we first got to knew, know about Celagen and that Miss Lee is launching it, and tell you frankly, I thought, wow. It's quite premium. Okay. Tell you bluntly, I thought, wow, it's quite expensive. Yeah. But then when I started taking it, I know why. Because within like three weeks, I start to feel there's something happening in my joints, especially my knee, because I was having osteoarthritis at that time. So th that was the gradual awareness of the benefit of cellogen and cell therapy uh, use it by using it myself. Yeah. So we have a video, okay, I will leave this screen, you can take a screenshot or you can do a QR code scan to watch the video. Do take a look, okay, if you want to take a look, you can look at it now or you can take a look later on, okay. So throughout my presentation tonight, 
I'll be uh, because we are unable to play video because of different bandwidth from different countries. Uh, I will be putting in QR codes. You can scan it or take a screenshot and then later on watch at your uh, leisure time. Yeah, and we are also inviting some of our associates to share their experience of using Celadon as we go uh, through the presentation. Okay, so Celadon, what does it do? And why is it uh, so many people are talking about it? Okay, it's a premium cell therapy supplement. So the main benefits really prevent degenerative ailments. That means anything to do with age, any ailments that relating to, because as you get older, age related, metabolic related issues, you want to look and feel younger, okay, boost vitality, improve immunity, which I felt, especially during this period, this is so important. Yeah, improve skin complexity, uh, complexion, okay boost sex drive and potency. I know in some countries, people are shy to talk about it. Some, some countries, they are really proud to say that they have low, they have a high sex drive and potency. So it doesn't matter which country you're from, Celagen works. Okay, what are the main ingredients? Okay, we are very transparent. We list out all our ingredients, even in the components that it is made up of. The ones in red, our proprietary com uh, components, bio-DNA cellular marine complex, peptide e-collagen, hydro MM peptide. These are all high in protein, made up of uh, peptides and also amino acids made up from the fish, fish of salmon and herring. And then we have these uh, complementary uh, ingredients like lutein, which is good for the eye, at the same time also for the blood vessels. Okay, skin, grape skin attract, extracts helps to thin and dilates our blood to promote circulation. That's why people who are uh, partial, having partial stroke or even uh, suffering from some poor circulation affecting their limbs and their movement, okay, grape skin extract really helps in this. Coenzyme Q10 is a well-known antioxidant. So uh, it's also, uh, in fact, many of these components, especially the, those in the asterisk, are high in antioxidants. Okay, what does antioxidant do? We all know from the literatures and all that, we know that we must take antioxidant. But why? What does it do? So antioxidants, like you see from here, it comes rich with all these uh, electrons. And then we have this free radical, which is derived from, remember in the, from the earlier slides, the different components, pollution, stress, that was derived, the free radicals that went into our body. What the uh, antioxidants do is they donate, they share one of their electrons with this free radical because they have an unbalanced uh, amount here. So when they become neutralized, they become a stable cell, no longer a free radical. So it's no longer a virus, no longer uh, an enemy inside your body. It becomes neutralized and then it becomes a healthy, stabilized cell. So cells can have different kinds, but you can influence each other. See whether you have enough abundance of antioxidant in your body. And antioxidant forms a, like a protection, like a layer of, a layer of shield that protects your cells, your DNA from being damaged. So all these, the more antioxidant you have, the bigger the shield, the thicker the shield. So you will always be healthy with no uh, free radicals being able to um, attack your cells. Come on, let's be frank and open about it. We cannot control the environment. We cannot control how much radiation the environment will have, will emit, how much pollution the cars will emit but we can control our body and how healthy we are. So that is my, my key message today in this seminar is no matter how the, how the environment is changing, we have control over our life and our health. I want to share with you about this book about, uh, by Dr. Ray Strand. Okay, he is a, a medical doctor, he's an MD. Uh, when his wife was diagnosed with fibromyalgia, he started looking for solutions. 
and he started finding what else can I do for my wife so that she gets well fast. She asked, he asked all his doctor friends, etc. But he, they were unable to find the source or in, in fact, no amount of medication was helping her and to recover and have the energy and feeling the vitality. So he started doing his own research on different uh, complementary wellness methodology and uh, different, different forms of wellness. And then after that, he practiced on his wife and his wife's health improved. And then he wrote a book about it. He said, the title was very interesting. He said that what your doctor doesn't know about nutritional medicine may be killing you. Okay. In fact, when I read that, it felt like he's attacking doctors. No, in fact, he's telling us that don't just listen to what the doctors say. You know your body best. Okay. And when you know different form of alternative, you can decide what works best for you and choose a methodology that will work for you. And in one of the chapters, he shared about how do you choose the supplements? There's so many supplements, so many. Everyone claims so good, right? You, you can walk into a pharmacy, you will find supplements. Okay, your, your healthcare professional, your GP will also give you supplements. Then you also go online, your parents will recommend to you, your, your siblings will recommend to you, but how do you then choose a good supplement? I would, I would like to share with you what he shared in his book. So if you have a chance to get his book, do grab a copy and read about it. Okay, he said that the supplements should be complete and balanced. The most you need to take is one to two. I know some of my friends who take a handful of supplements and then for three meals a day. And then I feel, oh, we will be so, so full by then, by just taking this supplement. So he, what he shared is the supplement is just uh, supplementing what your body needs. Okay, so you shouldn't be replacing your meals with supplements, but really to replenish what your body needs. Yeah? So one to two is sufficient enough. And then more antioxidants, the better. Like I share with you, the antioxidants helps to balance your free radicals into good cells and stabilize cells. So thus, your body needs a lot of antioxidants. Yeah? Wide range of antioxidants, not just one, but have a, a wide range so that your, your, your body has a balanced dosage of antioxidants. Pharmaceutical grade, grade okay, not just from any factory, but a pharmaceutical grade factory which is compliance with FDA, etc. Yeah? Marketed internationally. So it's not just catered for that specific market alone. When it's marketed internationally, there's more credibility, there's more certification. So the safety and efficacy of the supplement is of international standard. Third party certification. Okay, uh, do they have test reports, tests done by an uh, independent lab? And do they have certification from uh, uh, neutral bodies? Yeah. Reveal all ingredients. Okay, reveal all ingredients. Be transparent about it. Okay, no small print. Yeah. Reveal actual amount. Okay, reveal actual amount of the ingredients. Provide an expiry date. Provide company address, not just a PO box. That means to say, if anything, you want to really rectify or get to know, you know where to look for. Yeah. So these are the, the ingredients. You, uh, you will find it on our box as well as on our website, everywhere. These are the ingredients that made up of selogen and the components as well. We have abundance of antioxidant. There's this doctor who shared that, Dr. Stan Lim shared that the highest quality of ingredients is when you take something raw. That's why we, well, we encourage people to take raw food, raw veggie, raw uh, vegetables, etc. See, the closer the food comes to its nature state, when it's raw, unfired form, the higher its quality. Okay, in the market, the uh, supplements, um, extract, the extracts in the in ingredients of these supplements are in, there's two methodology. One is the cold extract uh, technology and there is the hot extraction. 
Okay, you'll notice that some supplements you need to take a lot because the active ingredients inside there is quite minor, okay, quite little. So thus, you need to take more to make up the dosage. But for Celagen, we use co-extraction technology. That means the, in the ingredients from its raw material is at its purest form, is at its rawest form. We never go through any heat technology, so no components were destroyed. Yeah? And then why co-extraction technology? The enzymes are intact. Okay, and there's amino acids are intact, the minerals and the life force is present. So when you take it, it's as good as taking the ingredients raw. Okay, what else? So these components, it has different benefits that it can help you. Like for example, BioDNA Cellular Marine Complex will give you vitality, relieve joint pain, okay, improve immune cells, protect your, you from radiation. Okay, then peptide e collagen. Once you hear collagen, uh, my lady friends will be very excited about it. But as I shared earlier, collagen is not just about looking pretty. It also protects our cell membrane. Yeah, so it helps to lift and tone our loose skin. Okay, provide relief from rheumatoid arthritis, minimize lines. Okay, pain relief from fibromyalgia, improve bone density, especially ladies after menopause they start to lose bone density. That's when osteoporosis, osteoarthritis, all starts to come in. Yep. Then we have hydro -MM peptide, helps with joint, uh, joint mobility. This was, I believe this was the one that helps me the most because when I take it, the, the whole, uh, my joint pain and the, fro the frozen joint pain, the knee pain was gone. And when I go up and down the stairs, it was much easier. So that was what I experienced, uh, the first thing that I experienced when I started Cerogen. Then here we also see the glycemic index reducing property. That means whatever carbohydrates that we input into our body, to our diet, it has the ability to break it down. Instead of storing as sugar, it converts into energy. That's why it's really helpful for people with diabetes condition. At the same time, also prevents us from having diabetes. Okay, lutein helps to protect the eye, okay, the skin as well as macular degeneration. Grape skin extract uh, helps with uh, 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 promoting circulation as well as remove brain, brain plaques. Yeah, uh, and also coenzyme Q10 helps to reduce cholesterol, etc. So all these are synergistically blended to make up cellogen. So you can see how precious one soft gel is. A lot of nutrients and components inside there. And what does it do? It helps in our cell regeneration. That means it gives our cells the nutrients that it needs. It gives us the energy and vitality. Helps in our reproductive system, immune system boosting, beauty enhancement, relief joints, glycemic index reduction, etc. We don't just claim or say anything about it. I will say, try it, test it out. But at the same time, we also are backed up by clinical research done by in independent uh, lab and published in different medical journal. You can Google about it and search all these journal that talks about how cellogen works. I will not be sharing uh, details about these journals and medical reports, frankly speaking, I do not understand after, even after reading the whole journal, but I know that what it means at the summary, yeah, because I'm not a medical profession. So what I want to share is the effect of cellogen was tested on liver cancer cells on a Petri dish. And when cellogen was introduced into it, there was a uh, notice that the liver cancer cells dies off naturally. That was a apotheosis. that means dies naturally. Okay, we want to be, we want to, as a disclaimer, we do not say cellogen helps with cancer cells. We are only saying that it can help prevent yourself from having cancer cells easily. Yeah, it has anti carcinogenic properties. It inhibits the proliferation, doesn't promote liver cancer cells from mutating. Okay, lower your risk of liver cancer and delay the development or progression of liver cancer. 
Okay. If it helps, if you have that effect on liver cancer cells, I'm sure generally over any of our cells, it's going to be helpful. Doctors recommend selogen. You will seldom see supplements being endorsed by doctors, by medical professionals, but we have a panel of doctors endorsing and uh, sharing with their patients. I would just like to quote one of, one of them from the US, South Carolina. Okay, he's a founder and medical director, and he said that our human body, we are fully capable of healing ourselves. But because of the modern lifestyle, the healing is taking longer and we are not patient enough to really slow down, to let it work. What is special about Celagen, they he said that it's not a pharmaceutical drug, yet it truly works on a cellular level to promote regeneration of our cells. And it can slow and even reverse the aging process. I will show you some of the pictures of our associates later. You, you tell me whether really this person aged or not. Okay, and we have our dear friend from uh, Philippines, one of the most well-known uh, doctor, aesthetic and plastic surgeon doctor, Dr. Florencio Lucero. Okay, he, he, was in, uh, he got to know about Celagen and he started using it himself and then he, he shared it with his patients. And he said, I gave Celagen to my patients so that before a surgery because it reduced risk. At the same time, they continue it as a home care regimen. And I love one of the th uh, things he shared about with us is Celagen complements my practice. Okay? I can give my patients not only the beauty, the, the mobility, but at the same time also the vitality, which is really crucial. You can look so pretty, but if you can't walk with energy, I feel it's really pointless. Thank you, Dr. Lucero, for sharing with us. Okay. And we also have a young doctor who shared with us recently. Okay, especially now, our frontliners, they are always working. They can't take leave, they can't take off. They are needed all the time. So important that our frontliners stay healthy. So this is one of our new interns who is the son of one of our, uh, our dear friends is also a doctor, she forced her son to take Celagen. And it's really heartwarming when the son shared that, actually, I'm thankful that my mom forced me to take Celagen. He says that since I started my internship, we have tough working hours. Normally, once he reached home, he would just conk out. And then next day, he has to go to work. And the mom usually needs to wake him up. But now, he, he has the energy. Okay, he will still be feeling the stress but he could wake up and stay alert and charge forward to another busy day. He works in one of our national university hospitals and he shared with us, he's only 20 plus. By right, most people this age will say, no, I don't need, okay? I don't need. So, but for him, he listens to his mom and in fact, he's very thankful that his mom forced him to take Celagen. So, Thank you for all your hard work, Dr. Ng, and many of the doctors in all at our front line. Celagen is nutrients for our cells. Okay, it is not a drug that only prescribed to doctors. We have many testimonies, many cases, many stories that we want to share with you. I have selected just a few to be in line with what we have shared earlier on. Okay, this is our dear friend from Philippines. Mr. Nani Almelda, he was a diabetic for seven years, uh, taking injection for 70 units daily. After seven months of taking Celagen, he now leads a normal life. He's, he doesn't need to inject insulin anymore. Yeah? And now, leading a healthy lifestyle, playing golf together with his family. And recently, uh, he, he shared a joke with us. He said that I've been hearing about my own story from other people. I think it's time I charge you guys for advertisement fee. <laughs> okay, and uh, another couple. Okay, this uh, couple, uh, the husband, the gentleman's name is Ed. Okay, he was diabetic since 1998. Okay, he became blind in 2000 okay, due to retinopathy. Uh, he started injection, uh, insulin injection for two years. Okay, and then... 
uh, injecting 24 units daily. After two months of Selagen, uh, I have to tell you, his eyesight, he didn't regain his eyesight, but I want to share with you something that really changed him. Okay, his medication reduced. Usually, this kind of maintenance drug, the, the dosage do not get reduced just like that. Yeah? And insulin injection also reduced. And he is feeling good about his own health. And he hoped that he could at least have some glint of light and shadow as the time goes by so that he can maybe walk on his own. Right now, he goes everywhere with his wife. This story prompted me to think, what if I could help, I could share with Ed and prevent this from happening? There will be a lot of what if. I wish I could. I wish I had known. Yeah, so now he said that at least now I know I'm taking Selagen. It won't deteriorate further. This next uh, sharing, okay, later on, it may be too graphical. Okay, I will just share very brief, uh, very fast. Okay, this is a, a gentleman from Indonesia. Okay, he was diagnosed with diabetes and he has to have his leg amputated, but he didn't want to. He said, let me seek a second opinion. Let me seek other, because amputating a limb, a leg is no joke. That means he's going to be wheelchair bound for life. Yeah. And he will be, in, he will be dependent on his family to take care of him. So he went around asking and his friends asked him to consider taking Selagen. Give it a try. Anyway, the most, at the end, if it doesn't help you, you have to amputate your limb. So he did. He gave Selagen a try and it really helped him heal his wounds. Okay, it's quite graphic. Okay, before Selagen, this was how his legs looked like. And after one year, it's completely healed. From this, from this to this, I feel so heartwarmed. He not only saved his limb, I feel he saved his life, his dignity, his, his, um, his whole lifespan is going to be different already. That's why he made a trip, especially to Singapore, to meet our CEO, to thank her for really coming up with this product. Next, we have our, uh, I would say, quite a, quite a young uh, person who have just started on Zalogen Valley about two years. Okay, and uh, she, I don't know if she's online, but she sent me her testimony. And then she, she for her, she was also diabetic. Okay, when she started taking uh, Zalogen, the reading was 7.9. And it gradually went down. Now to October, which is like a year later, 7.1. And throughout this whole time, she also lost 8 kg. Wendy, is, uh, I know Sally is a dear associate of yours. So you must have witnessed, you must have witnessed the transformation in her. Yes, yes, thing. Yeah. When I first met Sally, uh, when she first came to Avita, um, she told me that she couldn't even walk up this uh, overhead bridge when she goes home every day. She literally has to uh, hold on to the railing of this uh, overhead bridge and slowly climb up. Um, so, much, so much so that um, she stopped going up the overhead bridge. When she reached um, the MRT station, she would just take a cab home. After shortly, probably less than two months, she's able to go up the overhead bridge. She was so excited. She was so thrilled. Now she can't stop talking about Selagen. I'm sure. In fact, uh, when I met her, when I met her, she was sharing with me like, you know, it's really good. I've changed and my friends have started asking me, what did I do? Mm. Did I do something to my face? Did I go for a weight loss program, etc.? So. I hope next time uh, we get a chance to hear from Sally directly. Yeah, thank you for sharing, Wendy, and also Sally. Wendy, you might want to mute. Yeah, okay. And this one, it's a very special lady. 
okay? She's none other than my mom, my dear mom, who is 82 years old. Yeah, she's 82 years old and then uh, very healthy, uh, very fit. She used to suffer from glaucoma, which is the uh, high eye pressure and that could eventually could lead to blindness. But thankfully, she was well. Uh, when I first started giving her Celagen because of uh, her glaucoma issues, she started feeling a lot of vitality. She doesn't pant. She doesn't feel tired when she walks up the stairs. And at her age, she's traveling even at this current moment. She, she was uh, staying in the US for the longest time. But despite the crisis, she was like a, a month ago, she arrived in Melbourne together with, to be staying with my sister, family. And she's there right now. We just advise her, stay put, don't travel anymore. I know you're healthy, but 82 years old is not a good age to be traveling at this current moment. Yeah, so at least stay put there. So I'm very blessed and happy that because at this age, what else can you give to your, to your parents? I feel good health is the best gift. When they can live life doing what they like. And one of the things, I mean, if I may say, most parents, most elderly, do not want is to be dependent on a caregiver on, on their loved ones, to be a burden to their loved ones. So when we can give good health to them, I think this is the best gift. Yeah? And we also have our, our dear Maria, who was from who is from Hong Kong. Yeah, uh, when Celagen first started, she started taking it and she shared with us that her bones, her bone density increased. She was initially at a danger zone. Once you reach the red zone here, you are actually diagnosed with osteoporosis. Okay, osteoporosis. But then after taking Celagen for about nine months, less than a year, her level went up. Even her doctor was surprised. And said that, wow, what did you do? Okay, whatever you're doing, carry on. And uh, I, I, she was sharing with me that she will join in, but I don't know if she is there. Yeah, uh, but we are very happy. Every time she comes and joins us for any of our program or any of our events, she's looking so radiant, healthy, and really vital. Okay, and it's also helped with people who are going through uh, chemotherapy due to their cancer uh, condition. Okay, this is Amy, who is uh, diagnosed with breast cancer. And Celagen has helped her a lot, even throughout her chemotherapy treatment. It helped her to recover much faster, regenerate healthier cells. Okay, you can scan the QR code here to really watch her full video. And the, the video that uh, we have filmed her is recently about, just about two months or three months ago when she came to replenish her stock of Celagen in our office. And she's back to being a teacher, mixing around with young kids and really enjoying her life. Next, we have uh, this story, uh, this, this friend from Indonesia, Jakarta. Before talking about Ida herself, actually uh, Ruby, our dear friend in Singapore, first started on Celagen. And then from there, she benefited and she thought about her friend. Because when you benefit from something, you will think of your dear friend. You want them to enjoy the same. So she thought of her friend, Ida, okay, who was suffering from breast cancer at that time and regularly coming to Singapore for treatment. And it was during one of those trips that she shared with Ida. Is, I don't know if uh, Ruby is yes. online. Yes, yes Cindy. Ruby, are you ready to share yeah. with us? Uh, can you hear me? Yes. Uh, hi, everyone. Well, where do you get this photo thing? Yeah, they haven't seen it also. <laughs> uh, <laughs> well, what I can say is that since 2014, I took uh, Salagen. And um, what the, the best thing that it does to me is really give me abundance of energy. Um, I'm a trainer by uh, profession. And... Um, I can stand three days in a row doing training and focusing on the people that I'm, 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 uh, I'm uh, facilitating to. And not only that, I think what Tengi have shared earlier about joints, um, I, I have problem with knee, knees. Uh, but um, uh, after taking Salagen, um, it doesn't take long really. Uh, that It helps to um, my knees and I can walk. 
are much better, of course. Uh, what I think the key word is that it helps to heal um, faster. That's mm. the key word. Yeah. Okay. And yeah. Yeah. And when you uh, shared with Ida, uh, uh -huh. what was the first thought in mind? What would you like to when, help? When I, when I was told that Staragen can help in terms of uh, breast cancer, uh, Ida came to my mind. That was the first thing because she was, she was in Singapore uh, during that moment that I was introduced to Staragen. So I actually uh, introduced to Ida and um, when she did try two box. But within two weeks, she called me up and said, Ruby, what, what do you give me? This is fantastic. Yeah. Yeah. And, and since then, she never stopped. And um, she has been sharing and sharing with all her, her friends uh, in Jakarta. Mm. And what it gives her is also a lease of life, meaning to say that she is really very energetic now. She can travel back to back in Europe for the past two weeks. Wow. And uh, yeah, within two weeks, now she can go. And um, for your information, a month ago, she was in um, Italy or before. Whoa. The, yeah, you know, and and, uh, and she went to the, you know, the blue uh, rooftop, what's it called? Eh? That place. Uh, Santorini? Yeah, she was there with her husband. Her husband is 80, you know. But oh. she said that I came back on time because then, you know, the COVID started to do. But what she, she, she's really been anything for me. And I'm very pleased that um, she's still uh, recommending to her friends. And I'm very happy that every month she's really um, getting salvaging from us. Really Thank you. Wonderful. And it's all thanks to you. I you, know. You of her and share with her that her life, ben, uh, life improved, her health improved. And I think this recent uh, picture is at her wedding, right? Uh, yes, yes. Yes, and she's she looking got so married. beautiful. <laughs> And I can see all your beautiful smiles. Yeah, I think yeah. the biggest gift that we can give someone is good health. Yes, yeah, well said. Thank you for yes. sharing, Ruby. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah, yeah just like what Ruby shared, I think uh, it's really when you, when you want to help someone, you will think of a way and share with them. And next, we have this couple, uh, Oli and her husband, uh, Anga. Okay, uh, we do not know them personally last time before, before uh, embarking on Sarajan. Anga was actually in Singapore during one of his business trips and he was uh, shared about Sarajan. And then he came to our office and met our associate Joey who then shared with him about Sarajan. But unknown to us, he was actually looking for a solution to help his wife who was diagnosed with fibromyalgia, a disease that is uh, attacking the immune system. And really, uh, you, you never know how you will feel the next moment. Okay, and uh, you lost your, uh, you become frail, you lost your energy. And uh, what, uh, you can also scan the QR code. It's a beautiful sharing by both of them where the company interviewed them and they share straight from their heart about how Sergeant has helped them. And, what was life before when they started on Sarajan? Can I invite Anga to share a little bit? How is Oli and how is he now? And I know uh, Anga is one of our key leaders in Indonesia, sharing about Sarajan to many people. And in fact, even when my Indonesian friends come to Singapore, when I say, oh, Anga, uh, Anga and Oli, they say, oh, we know, we know, we know Pak Anga. We know him very well. He is well known in Jakarta. Yeah, so Anga. Hi, Anga. Hi, Oli. Hi. Hi, Pinky. Hi. Hi. Welcome Hi. and thank you for joining in. Uh, can you share with us how has Selgin really benefited Oli and not only Oli and many people in Jakarta as you uh, go about sharing? Thank you so much. Hi, good evening, everyone. Uh, I, hope, I hope I'm clear. Yes, we can hear you. Okay. Uh, if you have the chance to watch the video um, that uh, with the QR QR code link provided, uh, you would see a glimpse of uh, of the difficulties and limitations of autoimmune patient. Uh, in, in the case, in this case, uh, it is uh, Oli uh, is the fibromyalgia. In that video, uh, we acknowledge that Oli benefited significantly from uh, Cellergen and for that 
the every reason uh, we are convicted and would endorse it to anyone. So I would not uh, delve into the the problems that maybe uh, uh, taking time too much time here. Uh, everyone yes. can watch. And Good. and what actually made you feel that um, you are now also one of our uh, key leader in Jakarta? What makes you feel that you must really bring the word of Sarajan to all over Indonesia and beyond? What was your driving force? What really motivate and inspire you to do that? Because you can just enjoy the product, have good health, enjoy good health. But what makes you be inspired and motivated to really embark on it and share with so many people? All right. Uh, this, this made, you made me uh, look back and it's just a flashback to what, what began in 2013. All right. Oli and I have been in uh, Vitano for almost six and a half years. Uh, the people in Avita are warm and uh, it's just like being in another family. It is uh, unlike any companies I have ever been. And we are uh, actually fortunate to meet Avita. Uh, in the beginning, it was solely for all his help that we were initially in touch with Avita. And uh, nevertheless, despite the just consumers, all the consuming, Joey and Alvin uh, in particular, I remember passionately and patiently look after us. Uh, through Skype, Joey and Alvin and I would meet uh, after 10 p.m. Uh, daily to discuss at times uh, until past midnight. And then from this exchange of words, uh, I was convinced at one time that I could do more than just being a consumer uh, for such a good product. And uh, I started sharing with my uh, network and over time uh, it grew and I started getting <laughs> a box free for Oli. Mm -hmm. Now, wow. Joey, continu uh, Joey continued supporting me uh, comprehensively. I, I enjoyed his presence uh, without intruding, though I, I have no initial thought of being in a Vita business. Whenever we met, I remember Joey would patiently took out uh, his paper, white piece of paper and patiently making strategy and plan for me. And then uh, time flew and in January, I remember January 2018, Joey reminded me that I was ready to take the challenge uh, for Platinum Director. I remember how he has not changed a bit in his support for me as, uh, as consistent as uh, has always been. And the rest is uh, just a history. I became Platinum Director at the 10th anniversary of Avita. Yes. Yes. Yeah. And then here I am fully aware that I'm in the Avita business for a few years now. Yes. Mm, all I can say is uh, it is a fair and healthy business where everyone has room to grow. Mm. And uh, with helping hands of very helpful people in Avita who are very supportive. And then I would gladly encourage anyone to embark on this exciting yes. and uh, journey. Thank you so much for supporting all our Indonesian associates as well. And some of you who may not know, Anga has a blog that writes about Sarajan in Bahasa, Indonesia. Yeah, so thanks to leaders like him, more people can get to know about Sarajan and its benefits. Thank you for sharing, uh, Anga. And Oli, hi, stay safe. Good evening, everyone. Good evening. Yeah. Okay, now I shall move on. Okay, and uh, this is another of our associates. I don't know if you remember just now when we talk about uh, immune system, autoimmune issues. Uh, one of the things Sarajan helps is with people with psoriasis. And this is one lady, okay, or Aurelia. She's also from Jakarta. The first time I met, uh, it was during a training, and she was like very cheerful, very, uh, very vibrant, very bubbly. I never knew she has psoriasis issues until she shared with us over lunch and then she was telling, sharing with us the kind of difficulty she went through okay and how she felt having psoriasis. Psoriasis actually is a, like an uh, extra skin growth 
and she said that she always feel very heavy on her neck, her shoulder, and uh, she used to hunch because of the extra skin that she was carrying. After taking Selogen for two years, it helps with her uh, in this condition. It's almost gone. And to people like Aurelia, I would say this is priceless. As, just as she said, it's priceless. It helps her with her immunity. She's also here. I think uh, we will just let her uh, say hi. Yeah? Is Aurelia here? All the way from Jakarta. Thanks to technology, we can meet our associates even though we can't travel around, yeah? Hi, Aurelia. Can you Hi, Tenji. Hi. Uh, wow, so surprised to see me. <laughs> so surprised to see me. <laughs> yeah, thank you for joining in. Yeah, and then thank when, you. When I saw when I saw your name, I was like, "Oh, great!" Because I have your story. Yeah, oh, how are you? Fine, thank you. Hope and you are all everything? good there. Yes, good. Thank you so much for being here. I hope uh, not only your story and many stories that we are sharing tonight will benefit many people, including your family, your friends, and all our family and friends also. Yeah, nice hearing from you. Thank you. Yes. Take care. Stay safe. Yeah. You too. Bye now. Okay. Then uh, another another uh, story here is uh, of Lok. Okay, Lok is a good friend of Joey, one of our leader here. Uh, he was suddenly struck with stroke in 2017. Yeah. When a family member, especially the breadwinner of the family, have something like this, even not a breadwinner. Any family member who suffer something like that, a stroke, it really affects the whole family, not just that one person. You know, when your loved one suffered from this. So when Joey, being his good friend, heard about this, and he rushed to him and offered him the solution for his health crisis. He started him on Celogen and also one of our, another therapy, which is Meridian therapy, which is using essential oil to do massage, to, uh, on our acupressure points and along our meridians. Okay, this is another series of our products, which you will get to learn more as we go on a week by week basis on different topics. Yeah. So uh, since 2017, look diligently uh, use the products and practices. And in 2019, this was they were having lunch together, and Joey shared this picture with us. Okay, and wow, we were very glad to see look have, uh, improving and getting better. Personally, I do not know look, but when I saw and know about his story and saw his recovery, it is as if my brother has recovered as well. So that's the kind of joy we feel when we see another human being being well again. Okay, this lady, I, I, I think some of you may have seen this picture somewhere. She's very active on Facebook as well. She's our dear partner and friend in the Philippines. She, she has a long history, not because she is of age, but because <laughs> <laughs> she was from the States. She was one of the first Filipino to be in the U.S. Air Force okay, and to join in, as a, in, in the U.S. Air Force and then be part of the whole troop. And she spent her, most of her life in the U.S. Then Somehow, twist of fate, she went back to the Philippines, to her home country, to be, to be with her other family members there as well. And that was how we met each other, because she happened to be back in the Philippines, and she started on Selogen, because her dear friend introduced her to Selogen. She started, she was, on the, she, she used to look like the picture on the left, okay? I didn't get to see that part of her because when I knew her, she was slightly slimmer already. Yeah. Then this was the the picture on the right was about a few weeks ago. Yeah, a few weeks ago, and uh, I would like to invite her to share how she lost thirty pounds after Salogen. Is it she just take it and hmm, she lost, or what changed? 
why why was she like that before and what changed what makes what the what does selogen change to her let's see are you online yes hi hi tenji hey, thank you so yes. much please share with uh, everyone okay so when i came here almost three years ago in the philippines i came here actually after retirement after 40 years of service because i wanted to do absolutely nothing Okay, so because I'm so used to doing 10 jobs with just me, I came here to do absolutely nothing. So when you do absolutely nothing, guess what happens? You, get you become bad. lethargic, you become lazy, and you gain weight. And uh, I also got uh, slightly depressed, well, mm -hmm. more than slightly. So at that point, um, I just didn't want to do anything else. In fact, to the point to where I also did not want to live anymore. And so after, you know, after a year of being like that, I had to do something. So a friend of mine uh, brought me over to Avita Philippines and we, where we met DP Genie. And she insisted that I try Selogen. I said, no, I don't want to try that. Actually, I walked out on her. <laughs> but, you know, after persistence, I walked out to the showroom and I saw the oils there and I said, well, what's that? So I got interested with the oils. Um, and so I got invited back for the three times and each time they, they kept insisting for me to try Selogen. And finally I did. And wow, what a difference. After the first three or four days, I had so much clarity and I knew something had changed inside me because I felt the energy, I felt the will to live again. And so after six months, um, you know, because being in the military, I had so many things wrong with me. I was broken. I was literally broken. I had high blood pressure, high cholesterol, high blood sugar, and fatty liver. That's why I couldn't lose the weight. So after doing that and also doing the oils, the meridian oils, and doing gua sha on myself, and a lifestyle change, of course, um, I wanted to be healthy and I had so much energy that I now exercise every day, I eat healthy and proper supplementation. Actually, Tenji, I lost 40 pounds. 40 pounds, still okay. Losing. Yeah, please don't sue me for this. Okay, you lost another 10 more pounds. <laughs> <laughs> wonderful, wonderful. And it goes to show that once you are determined, once you're back on the path, your life will change forever, yes? Thank you for yes. sharing with us and coming online, Betsy. And uh, right Thank now you. you are in Manila, uh, still under yes, lockdown. I but I always enjoy watching all your videos. She will do planking, she will do meridian dance, and keep sharing about wellness tips to everyone yeah, through Facebook. Thank you very much, Betsy. Thank you. Okay, you can also watch her full video uh, by scanning the QR code there. Yeah. Okay, and... Uh, Last but not least, there is this story I would really want you guys to watch okay, on, on video. You can also scan here. It's a story from Taiwan. Okay, our, our friend Mao Mao, who is a dear friend of uh, one of our leaders, Xiu Ling. Okay, they met uh, through another friend, through a church mate, when uh, the church mate knew about the condition of the husband. He was suddenly struck with brain, brainstem stroke and uh, do most doctors in Taiwan have given up and then say that's, there's no uh, cure for that. And then maybe you can seek uh, stem cell therapy in Russia and things like that. So they went. They used all their savings. They went for that and come back, but still not much progress. So the friend, uh, the church friend introduced her to Siu Ling and Siu Ling shared with her about cell therapy, cellogen, also about our nerve for our nerve regeneration, nerve, nerve cell regeneration, NGF, and also meridian therapy. And Mao Mao diligently helped her husband. Okay, and one of the first things that they use to, uh, to communication using some phonetics, uh, he, the first message he said to her was, thank you for saving my life. I want to live on. That was the message and until today, you know, Mao Mao never gives up, neither did his, her husband, and he's on his way of improving. He, his eyes can really focus on you, 
okay, like previously he couldn't. So watch the full story here. And really, after watching this video, I felt, how can I put a price on Celagen when it can help so many people's lives change that way? And please, for those who invited you, who are here for the first time, whether you're tuning in from Facebook or from Zoom for the first time and getting to know us, thank the friend who invited you. Say, come and listen to this. Because by knowing this information, even if it may not be directly benefiting you, this information, you could reach out to someone and help another person's life and help. You know that I care for you about your health when I share Celagen with you. With this in mind, that was how we came up with this presentation and wanted to share about the goodness and how it could help with you, with your health at cellular level. This was also what I see when I embarked on Avita and Celagen because there's so many problems in the, in, in the out, outside world right now. Let's not even talk about the pandemic because we know the severity of it. But after this pandemic, are you going to go back to its normal? Still living life the way it is? Or are you going to take control of your own life? To me, Celagen, this product and Avita platform allows me to make a difference. This became the tool for me to reach out to the world. Thus creating opportunity to me for me to be a speaker, to be a wellness advocate, to go out there and touch people's life. Thus, Avita becomes the solution that I provide to many people out there, to many families out there, as well as many entrepreneurs to be out there who are looking for a wellness platform. The world aging population, okay, it's going to continue. The world is aging. Okay, and viruses like COVID-19, will it stop? Is it the largest pandemic ever? We don't know. We had SARS in 2000, uh, 2003, yeah, 17 years ago. We didn't expect something like that. In between, there were a few viruses that came about, but we didn't really bother. But this one hit us hard. I think there is a message underlying it. We've got to do something about it. We've got to be prepared. Our health must be prepared. Avita has a whole personal healthcare system. Here, I'm only touching on the cellular level part of it. Okay, the rest, you can take uh, your time to know about it. And we, will all, we also have a series of talks on it. What we want to care for is your personal health and your loved ones. So we have presence in all these countries. So if you are from any of these countries, you can contact the local office there and we can support you from there. Starting from 2019, we are also having our presence uh, in, in all these countries, Thailand, Myanmar, Vietnam, Cambodia, Brunei. We do not have a physical office, but we will support logistically from our office in Singapore. Yeah, so as long as you're in all these countries, you can get hands on your hands to all these products as well as our platform. I would like to end off by saying that at any given moment, you, you, me, me, okay, have the power to say, this is not how the story is going to end. I'm not going to give in to just a pandemic. I'm going to take charge of my life and my health. I'm going to do something about it. I'm going to keep myself healthy so that I have enough antibodies in our body so that my, my, my body is well, my immune system is good. Not just myself. I don't want to just end up alive alone. I want to have all my friends to enjoy this life together. So thus, I'm going to keep sharing. Okay, it's, The decision is yours, but to me, I have to take control of my life. I want to do something about it. and I'm not going to let the story end this way. I'm going to end it in a colorful, healthy, and vibrant way. So I hope my sharing has helped in uh, shedding some light into what is cell therapy, what is cellular therapy, and how our cells fight with each other, yeah, and what we can do to mediate. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'll pass over to Wendy now. Thank you, 